Boo Woman Athletica include. S problem isn't just that a batch of its black yoga pants were made to sheer and had to be recalled. The popular retailer is now downgrading its financial predictions and watching its stock do a downward dog. The Vancouver, BC, company said late Monday that it pulled the women's pants from its stores and e commerce sites over the weekend after learning that the material was too revealing. The Luan fabric is produced in Vietnam and Taiwan and made with a mix of nylon and liquor spandex fibers. In a lengthy fact posted on its website, the chain said it was still investigating how a batch of two stumpy pants was allowed to reach stores in early March. Boo Woman hasn't changed its manufacturers or ingredient quality since 2004, it said. Or, in the company's words, the ingredients, weight and longevity qualities of the women's black on bottoms remain the same but the coverage does not, resulting in a level of sheerness in some of our women's black on bottoms that fall short of our very high standards. Boo Woman is now offering affected customers full refunds or exchanges while also warning of an impending shortage of black yoga pants. The recalled apparel makes up 17% of the women's pants and crop pants Boo Woman sells in stores. But it's more than practitioners poses being affected, Boo Woman said the issue will have a significant impact on its financials. The company lowered its expectations for an 11% increase in same-store sales and revenue between $350 million and $355 million for its first fiscal quarter. Now, Boo Woolman is projecting the 5% to 8% same-store sales range and revenue between $333 million and $343 million. The company will unveil its fourth quarter and full-year earnings on Thursday. But already, analyst Sam Hoser of Stern, G and Leach downgraded Lou Woolman's shares to a neutral rating from buy, telling investors to back off until quality control concerns are alleviated. Lou Woolman had been riding the recent surge in demand for women's athletic wear, along with competitors such as Gap include S Athleta, Under Armour Incorporated and even mass market retailers such as Forever 21 and Victoria's Secret. In early morning trading, Lou Woolman's stock fell as much as 5.9%. As of 9.15 PDT, it was down $3.60, or 5.5%, to $62.30.